from WNDU, your severe weather station. This is News Center 16 at 5 in high definition. Coming up, have your aging eyes forced you to pick up a pair of reading glasses? Well, there's a new procedure that could help you get rid of those specs. I'll tell you all about it next in my medical moment. The latest health news for you and your family. This is Maureen's Medical Moment. An innovative surgery could have you throwing away your reading glasses. The story in today's medical moment. It's an eye condition no one can escape from, and it's what makes reading glasses so popular. Once you turn 40, your eyes start to have trouble focusing on close words in books, newspapers, and other tiny objects. But some doctors say an experimental eye surgery could be the fountain of youth for our eyes. Marla Husky knows how to work her magic in the kitchen. With a large family, um, we don't go out to eat much. <laughs> As she gets older, she finds herself doing less chopping and more straining. And any time I got ready to cook, the glasses went on. An experimental procedure could turn back the clock for aging eyes. After age 40, um, every year, the distance that we can read things clearly began to recede from us. As we age, the lens inside our eyeball grows, but the eyeball doesn't. Tighter quarters around the lens make it harder to focus. In a new procedure, surgeons implant four curved plastic spacers the size of a grain of rice within the wall of the eyeball, giving the lens space to change shape and focus. Look to the left, look to the right. Molly Stewart had the surgery one week ago. It improved her vision from 2100 to 2040. I can already tell a difference when they're doing the eye tests on me and I can read below the average line. Dr. Ming Wang says the surgery takes 15 to 20 years off the eye. Marla's vision also improved to 2040. Oh, it's just fun to think that I can see as good as I could when I was in my mid-20s. Now she's back focusing on more important things than finding her glasses. To qualify for the procedure, patients must be 50 to 60 years old with no prior eye surgeries and good vision aside from reading glasses. Only three centers in the U.S. are performing the experimental surgery in New York, Nashville, and Chicago. If the patient doesn't like the outcome, the surgery can be reversed. And to read the research summary for today's story, go to WNU.com and click on the medical moment.